Let's take Dave Ratt, the owner of, or the founder of Ratt Sound Systems. What kind of experience would you respect seeing for new guys entering as entry level employees for your company? That's a great question. And that's been, like many things, something that's morphed over time. You know, it's a developing uh, perception or developing um, idea for us. And it used to be, you know, as someone who started the company, was looking for other people that had these vast skill sets, somebody who could load a truck and wire the boxes and wire the racks and mix the show and trying to look for these Swiss Army knife humans. Um, and over time, just through experience and logic, kind of learned that those people tend to be, that the, there's a specialist. You know, when you first work a club, you're, you go in, you set up the monitors, you set up the mics, you go up front, you dial in the wedges, you dial in the house, you're stage manager, front of house, monitor engineer, and stage tech all in one. Maybe you do lights on the side. Each of those tasks on the upper levels has turned not only into a separate human, but then it turns into a whole department and a whole truck. So every small task expands out. Um, that's awesome. Uh, you know, and then that can't, you know, you, then like looking at like the space shuttle, no hu one human could actually build the space shuttle. It's a whole department of every one person. Just the magnitude of that is fascinating. So taking that concept into action, making that actionable as we over time began building our crews and hiring people uh, more like an Ocean's Eleven, Ocean's, like a, like a, like a robbery movie. Yeah. <laughs> where you've got maybe you've got somebody who's nothing but muscle and you've got and just wants to load the damn truck yeah. and get that stuff in and out and you got another person that's all smarts that wants to come in and figures out everything fixes everything that's broken doesn't do so good in the truck but might help a bit if need be and then you've got someone who's a people person who gets along with the, the band the production manager who's the natural moderator um, and you know, so trying to put these crews together that have a diverse skill set, but a little bit of knowledge everywhere else. And that's where this opportunity comes. We can still have our dreams and desires of what we want to master, but having these foundational skill sets everywhere else. So you do want to be a bit of a Swiss Army knife, but you also can really specialize as well. Uh, so putting these uh, multifaceted crews together not only applies to skill sets, but it applies to race and gender and scholastic backgrounds. So, you know, having somebody who's gone to college and people, there is no, you want to have as diverse a group as possible if you really want to have all your bases covered and have an optimal team. Yeah, and it's, it, whereas before, like you said, it'd be like four guys trying to do the whole operation. Um, now it's maybe four guys in the audio department and four more in the lighting department. Mm -hmm. um, so if, if... And then you have four on stage. <laughs> and then right. you have three yeah. more out front. <laughs> yeah. 